Hey, Andre. Well, every night so much is asked of Paul Millsap. He's so consistent at so many different things. A very complete player for this team. Whenever someone's hurt, you ask more of Paul Millsap, especially when Dwight Howard's hurt, being the only other starting big. So, Paul, in the two games that Dwight has missed so far, his minutes have gone up. He's playing almost 40. He averages in the low 30s, and he's had double-digit rebounds in these past two games. Obviously, his role changes when he plays the five in his place, but in various lineups that we'll see today, Tonight, it changes his role as well. It changes a little bit, but not much. I think the um, overall, we want to be an aggressive team. We want to be a good defensive rebounding team. Um, we want to be a good defensive team. You know, I know Dwight helps us with that. Um, without him, it's going to have to be a little better. Where are you all affected most when he's not there? Um, just rebounding and just shot blocking abilities. Um, we're all just going to have to pick up that load. Small ball for you all works so well at times and against certain teams. What do you like when that's clicking and when that's working? Um, we have a lot of mismatches on the court at that time. Um, we're fast. We're moving around. We help each other. Um, when we play that lineup and we play with energy and guys are getting down there getting, getting hits on guys, I think we're at our best. If not, you know, we suck at it. So hopefully we uh, do the best we can when we, when we do it. If we see that at times tonight, how do you like that against Denver? How does that match up? Um... Should do pretty good. I mean, they got um, pretty much four four wings um, on the perimeter, so um, it'll match up pretty well. Um, we like our chances if, if it happens. So a different look, obviously, for the Hawks with Chris Humphreys in the starting lineup. And Coach did just tell us a couple minutes ago that Dwight's progress with his back soreness is going upwards in the right direction. And that's why he didn't travel. They don't want even the travel, the plane ride, the altitude here in Denver to affect what is just a tight and sore back. Also with Tim Hardaway Jr. with his right groin injury. He tried to go this morning at shoot-around, and they just decided he couldn't. But Coach is hopeful that when we get back in Atlanta, they'll be able to re evaluate him and see if he'll be able to play in Minnesota. Back to you guys.